What is up, guys? Welcome back to an awesome episode of Railroads Online. My name is Evil One, and today I am joined by the one and only Dolan. Say hi, Dolan. Hello. And we got James on board today. Say hi, James. Hello. And we got some excellent news. So it sounds like the gold rush really kicked off up in Alaska, and there was a railroad company up there that they didn't quite make it. It sounds like they started doing pretty well, but the bad management skills and, and whatnot, and then all of a sudden, one of their big locomotives got taken out by an avalanche, which basically buried them. So this railroad company, they contacted me looking for an investor and some help. They needed some advice, since we are very successful here at the ad and So I saw it as an opportunity to purchase that railroad company. So we're going to Alaska, boys. I figure the best way to get rich off this gold rush thing is by supplying the gold miners themselves instead of gold mining. What do you guys think? Sounds good to me. Yeah, awesome. Sounds good. Sounds really good. So unfortunately, though, the miners and everybody up there, they're hungry. They're running out of food. Uh, they're freezing to death. Uh, they don't have any fuel. So we need to get to Alaska, like, real soon. And it's making me a little nervous. We're kind of up against the clock here. It's a long ways to go. We're not quite ready here. Uh, we got to run some trains here to try and get a train configured, switched up to head to Alaska. Yeah. So I think we got a, a train that's going to head to the cattle farm. It's going to pick up a bunch of cows, take them up to Emmett Hill to be processed, turned into canned food. And I think Dolan's going to take that train, right, Dolan? Yep. All right. What locomotive, what engine did you want to take? I'm going to take the Cook Mobile. All right. Oh, it's a and classic. James, uh, we got the, the Lima over there reward, and it's got a bunch of coal cars, uh, half of which are already full, and we got the new Gondola High Sides. Let's go take a look at it. Well, oh, yeah, I haven't, took, I, haven't, I haven't taken a good look at these. But they look pretty. So here we got these high sides. And they are empty. But again, we have a couple of full uh, coal cars here. So these coal cars, they need to be taken up to Emmett Hill to the processor and unloaded there so they can start processing these cattle. And then if you want to continue on to the coal mine, fill up this entire train with coal. And bring it back here. We'll be taking this train to Alaska. Can you do that? Oh, yeah, that, yeah, yeah. I can use it. Yeah, that's yeah. Alaska should do. All right. <laughs> Have fun. Let me know if you need help. <laughs> and so what I'm going to do. Yeah. This is the the cattle car or the cattle train here that Dolan is going to be taking, and I'm going to be taking this train here. This is the cordwood train and we got a little bit more I guess good news and Ooh. that is Beast is dead the legendary beast is done the legendary beast is done mechanics went through it all fixed everything that needed to be fixed retested the boiler I opened up the wrong doors here Got a new fresh coat of paint. Now I gotta Beast. take a look at this. A, D, and D. But we kept it still as number two. So we actually have two number two engines here at the A, D, and D. What could possibly uh, go wrong? <laughs> uh, but I, I didn't really want to change the number. I thought about making it number one, because it is the OG, but it's number two. It's always been number two. I can't fix it. We'll get it warmed up. I'll be riding in Beast, taking the cordwood up to the logging camp and getting it all loaded up. All right, I am back in, heading to my locomotive.
Alright. Alright. Good. Right direction. That's the way I want to go. Good. Alright, so you're good, Dolan. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna head and grab a uh, beast, look up to my train, and I'll get out of here as soon as you all are. Well, I'm just. I just passed the freight people, so I'm basically out of here. I'm gonna head towards the junction, and then wait for James to make it on his way. Which make my way downtown. We're heading in the same direction, James. I just realized that. Cause you gotta uh, pass James the meat packing hurt. plant. Yeah. You gotta pass the meat packing plant to get to the location. He's gotta he's gotta unload at the meat packing plant. Yeah, no, I gotta pass the cattle cattle yard to go to the meat packing plant, if I'm not mistaken. Well you can go you can go past the logging camp. Sawmill? No. Or, yeah. Sawmill. You can go past the other part of the lumber chain. We'll oh, right, yeah, there is that line, too, isn't there? I forgot about that part. I'm still learning. <laughs> no worries. I believe that was me. I'm going through the sawmill, just whistling through the industry. Yeah, uh, I just passed the uh, smelter, so. And I am at the cattle. Awesome. Awesome sauce. It is good to be in Beast again. Beast was the absolute workhorse at the Ramblin' Railroad. They moved a lot of freight for us. I'm just glad they found it. Right? It's running like a top. Don't you moo at me, cow! <laughs> it's not going moo, it's going boo. <laughs> Alright, just finished loading. And I on. I really hope my switches are set. I doubt it. But I'll make sure. Um. Hard to say on that one. I think being evil took the same route. Yep. But you're coming around the back side of the mountain, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So as long as I'm not set to go into the iron mine, I should be fine. Even if I do go into iron the iron mine. And then the Y for Alaska. And then the smelter. But yeah, you got some switches ahead of you. It'd be nice to know the uh, outline. Just hit M to see the whole track outline. Apparently it's coming. I know. I just wish it was. Oh well, I mean, now, yeah, you, now then, then later. <laughs> you throw the save file into uh, Railroad Studio, and you can just download the picture. I know. 
but you can't remote switch the switches while you're playing. That's the big unfortunate thing. I... Oh! I mean, oh, hey. I see Beast. Yeah. Like, Almost. we're not in Alaska yet. It, like, it, it is nighttime, but it's just still in the daytime, but, you know. It's right. 5 o'clock sun. Uh. Is it Toby Keith? Jimmy Buffett. Oh, is it Jimmy Buffett? Yeah. Yes. Jimmy Buffett and Alan Jackson. Uh, yes. So. We don't I'm have seasons up. yet in this game. So we are saying that it is summertime. So Alaska is actually brighter a lot longer than it is night. So, yes. There's that. I know they did start putting in the implement for uh, four seasons, uh, like on. Oh, The handbrake is on the uh, tender. I haven't took. I didn't take it off. All right, Just an FYI. You. All right. The cattle unloading side. We gotta head to that. We're gonna pull forward. Yeah, I, I was confused. I'm like, why is he going on the other side? Doesn't he only have to unload the cattle? It's like, uh oh. <laughs> See, my first thing was is that. I had tried slowing down because I was having some, uh, I was having, a, uh, I saw my, my engine and the tender had got uncoupled. 
and I was like, okay, what's going on? So I start started to slow the engine down. And then immediately yep. my game crashed. <laughs> and that's when the fun started. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> it's okay, we were on it. Yep. <laughs> I sent that James. message in chat hoping that somebody would see. I didn't see a message in chat. Yeah, I didn't see a message in chat either. Was I don't have a, I don't have two um, I don't have two um, computer screens up right yeah, now. I, I do, and I don't see a, a new message anywhere. It's in general voice text chat, or because I sent that for my phone, which was using a cellular. Oh. Oh yeah, oh. there it is. It just didn't. Make it big for me. Or, uh, um, highlight it. Ping. Yeah. Alright, Evil One, I am sitting here waiting for you to pass. Once you pass, I'm gonna pull out onto the main line and back down towards the unloading. Perfect. You are hightailing. Yep. 31 mile an hour, 32 mile an hour. No. Oh. And here's me taking it easy on the, on the edge of the mountain cliff. <laughs> oh, Evil One's gonna be back to Ironburg before we even think about yep. being back. I mean, once I get this unloaded. I should be on my way back immediately. Well, you have to load up the food. Yeah, get this unloaded and load up here. And then I'll be on my way back. I hope that's a desync. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, come on. Alright, we can only have... Are you flying Batman kidding me? Correctly. Doing what correctly? Unloading the cabin. I don't know. Are they going into down their little chute? No, it's the uh, the unload's not even activated. Uh oh. Hit enter. Well, that's what I did. It's not. It's does it give you the arrow still? It should. it should give you the arrow and then hit enter. It's really finicky, you gotta... There we go. side for the new packing plant. So load it up. I am at the smelter. Alright. You're just flying, buddy. Yeah. Not wasting any time. These people Don't in Alaska you. need us. <laughs> Not my fault. 
People who, who are running the railway up there should have ha had better planning management. Well, hopefully we can make it work. We don't necessarily yeah. have a botless record for uh, railroad management either, Dolan. Hey now, hey, don't now, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Check a tally. Uh, like, we've only been kicked out of one place. We haven't been kicked out of here. No, they yet. love us here. We're, we're making their industry uh, a lot of money. We're the reason they're thriving. Yep. So, I'm, I've only got 12, 12 corned beef, so... Is it still populating? Is it just taking forever, or...? I don't know find out. That's it. Or 22. Yeah, 22 crates. Alright, let me shut the door. I don't, want the, I don't want it to spoil. Yeah, that'd be bad. Yeah. Yeah, you kind of need a, a hot fire to make steam. All right, I'm on my way down. I do love the little yard that was built here from the captain plant. Is that because you built it? Maybe. I do love how the uh, the tracks actually kind of go through the town, too. I didn't build that, I think. James, that was you who built it, wasn't it? Yep. It was James and I. Yes. Yeah, yes, yeah. evil one, and we did that. Oh. I know there was somebody else I couldn't remember.
back up, please. Just put it next to that other uh, train there, the one that I had, please. Are you parked in the main station tracks or in the yard? I'm in the side yard there. Am I linked up to, um, or... Yeah, just go ahead and link up to him, please. Oh, um, I, I haven't checked links. Okay. Sorry. No worries. I just didn't want to just go back and assume that they're already all, like, set up or not. That is from the top. One second here, I'm still building some track. Yep, no worries. It's gonna take me a minute to, um... You're good. Get some desync now again with the coaches. The coaches have rolled back onto the main line. <laughs> No, I'll just plow through them if they derail you, then uh, take a screenshot. Well, I'm, I'm already at the roundhouse. Oh, gotcha. I'm about to put the arrow away. Get error. If you want to get a uh, shove or, or push or something, then actually hook those two trains together. What I'm gonna do is Maybe. probably just take the one, the one um, ventilator box out okay. and put it with the corporate cars. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. Let's have it at the front of the train, that ventilator box car. Know what I mean? Yeah. Don't want yeah, I heard you. Okay. <laughs> oh. No, we'll put these this coal train uh, at the back of the train, I guess. I do like I think there's a break or two on the uh, end of the cars. I didn't even check. Yeah, there probably is. What's that, Dolan? I do like how the maps are spaced out. Especially where the fact is, is you could leave the rail yard here and get your frames back almost. Holy moly. Yeah, I agree. And I think uh, when we get this train back down there, we'll disconnect them. We'll take these high-side gondolas only. 
uh, and we'll leave these full uh, EBT hoppers uh, there and we'll use them here at Lake Valley. Let's go uh, ahead one big long yeah. train or car. Do the ventilate. Oh, what side of the yard? Bring in a caboose with us. Yeah, we're gonna need a caboose. We're gonna need a. It's gonna take a while to get to Alaska. We're gonna need a place to stay. Mm -hmm. 
I turned that bell off like a month ago. <laughs> so, the high side gondolas used to that, but they hold 22? 22, yeah. yeah. Alright. Oh, you got three of them. Cool. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run back and go grab one of the Cabooses. And then I'm gonna push the Caboose onto the end of the gondolas and then pull the gondolas out. Oh. Bounce. Oh, the wrong way. Oh, my bad. No, no, oh shoot, I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry, James, we actually were. I, I thought right that's way. how you backed up. <laughs> because we were going the wrong way. Yeah, it was, <laughs> but we were going the right way to begin with. <laughs> Good grief. Uh, shenanigans. Not the Sam Elliott hell. Alright. You sure this way? Yeah. Yes. Positive. Ninety percent. Side up. Don't pay attention to what just happened. Okay, I won't. I saw everything. No, you didn't. Nothing happened. Why are you off the rails, there, buddy? I'm not. I'm on the rails. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Third reverse. Man, these things got a bit of weight to them. I also have brake on. Oh, it's... there we go. Oh, yeah, it was that brake on. Right? <laughs> yeah, you can tell the difference. <laughs> They're nothing for the Ruby Basin. Or like paper. I mean, the Ruby Basin has what got almost the same amount of tractive effort it has. Yes. Her head? It has a bit more than the cook, you said. Forward. Yeah, uh, about like 2,000 more. I think. I think Beast's only got more. Oh, this is definitely going to put Beast to the um, ultimate car. test. Contact. That would have been the most perfect stop. Alright. While you're putting that away, I'm going to run ahead and, and make sure our track is good. Set all of our switches so we can just get the hell out of here. If I actually start at the front of the train. Yeah, probably. Alright, Chuff. How am I faster than the engine? This makes no sense. I must be Superman. <laughs> well, they did. They did. Uh, I mean, I'm. I'm not even going on max. I know. It still bugs me. It's like I. I should not be this fast. But you're probably going what? Fifteen. Yeah. I. I, I should not be. I. I. Sh yeah. I should not be going this fast. Pitmuth and I actually clocked John Robertson uh, at one point, and he was doing like 14 and a half miles an hour. <laughs> it's not as fast as the fastest man in the world, but... Faster than me. Thank 
actually, I think I clocked this is back in high school, I was just like 16. Before I messed up my knee. <laughs> For a John Rollerton being like an 87 million year old dude, <laughs> he's pretty spry, you know? <laughs> <laughs> right? I wonder what kinds of people will run into when we're up there. Sasquatch. Ah, I doubt it. <laughs> Bandits. Probably. Well, if there's gold, there's bandits. Okay, are we good? We are clear. Alright, let's meet back at the... James, do make sure we have no brakes on. Hold it. We all set to take the yep. uh we're set to go to Alaska. 